So today, me and Emma decided we are going to go to a goat show over in Cushing, Oklahoma. So we got her two weathers and we took them over there just to mainly get them out for the first time this year. Uh, Emma's struggling washing this one right here. Um, these are the ones that she walked in a couple videos back, probably five or six videos back. I can't remember the, name, the title of the video right now. But it's just Emma and I today. And we decided we were going to go to this goat show with uh, a friend of ours and his granddaughter. Emma can't step farther down in the wash rack because there's about six inches of water. You see how high up on her boots the water is there. There's just so much water. It's just ridiculous. Blow drying a goat, and no Phil took the blower from her, and he kept blowing it on her. And she didn't realize what he was doing. He was just sitting there having a good time. so loud in the barn I have to add audio after the fact because the the barn is just so incredibly loud with I think there was 200 goats and 200 sheep at the goat at the show it was a goat and sheep show here they're doing a little clip and just touching them up we didn't want to shave them all the way like a lot of people have in the videos you can see a lot of people um, clipped them all the way down like the one right behind it in the video. It's almost shaved all the way to skin. We didn't do that because it's getting cold in the video or in two days. And so we didn't want to get the goat sick by shaving them all the way. And this is the second goat. Emma already got the other one uh, roughly ready. And then right before she goes in the ring, we'll pull them both back up, or one at a time, up on the blocking stand and get them uh, touched up. Anything else that we have to do to them, we'll do that right before she goes into the ring. That way they don't just get overly stressed out, which Emma works with her goats a lot. That's why they're just standing there being nice and calm. And here she, her and uh, Phil, the guy that we did a lot of the goat stuff with, they're clipping it right now. And Emma's wanting to do the fit contest at our local, or at our county show. So she is really watching Phil on how he's dragging the clippers, one way to blend, one way to cut. She was asking a bunch of questions, but you guys couldn't hear it on the camera. Emma's got to try to blow dry her. She's blow drying her pants because they got so soaked while she was washing. Emma. Emma. That's the two goats she's gonna show, right? The one here, and then the one in the in the little blanket down there on the other side of the big one. You're getting him ready right before the 
she goes in the show. Hey, hang on a second. I'm about to get that touch right here. No, you didn't see me a lot in this video, but I am there. Just like uh, here, for just a split second, I popped out just to record because I want. That's part of the whole showing experience for me, anyway. And that's how it was when I was a kid. Is you learn how to do all of it. You learn how to wash the goat. You learn how to. Well, I didn't do goats per se. I did hogs, cattle, and sheep, and. Here Emma goes with her first goat. She's right there and she's taking him out there. She's in a little bit bigger class here and she didn't do bad. I think she ended up in uh, third out of five. Here she is coming with her second goat. She's in a smaller class. There's only two in her class. And the goat in front of her, he didn't have all the hair Emma's had on it. But like I said earlier, we didn't want to shave them all the way down. And then them get sick because we are, it was 70 degrees in the day of the the day of the show but on Wednesday it's supposed to get down to 30 something 30 degrees and then on the Thursday it's supposed to be 18 degrees so we just didn't want to get them sick and a lot of these people they have big heated barns and things in this part of the video Emma had to go back in with her second goat because it was picked as the division champion so now she's back in there for reserve division champion uh, unfortunately she didn't get it but she had a lot of fun while she was doing it over the weekend well guys I hope you enjoyed this little different formatting of the video it's just Emma showing and like always I hope you enjoy it come back see us again and thanks for watching